They were seen in large numbers before the 2011 tsunami, and we're starting to see them again. This is the oarfish. The oarfish is the longest bony fish in the world. Full-grown adults get to about 8 meters long on average, but there are confirmed sightings of 11 meter long individuals. But anyway, you came here to find out if they're really prophets of doom. And the answer is obviously, sometimes. They're not great swimmers due to their tiny, underdeveloped muscles. They also lack swim bladders to control their buoyancy. This makes them very susceptible to sea currents, which is sometimes caused by seismic activity. When the sea is angry, the current might push older, weaker, and sick individuals into shallower water. So if you've never seen this fish before, and suddenly a massive one washes up on your local beach, and then soon after an earthquake happens, you might be right in assuming that there's correlation, but there really isn't any causation. There are many possible reasons why we've seen so many oarfish recently. Water pollution, changes in temperature, noise pollution from sonars, a decrease in prey availability, diseases, or simply natural causes are factors that might lead to more oarfish dying in a certain area.